All right, dudes and dudettes, welcome back to Seopolis. Guys, I'm so excited we're getting into Mechanism today. Let's get this. So, Mechanism. Yes, it... How do I have 180 levels? Oh, the Mob Farm, that's right. So yeah, uh, Mechanism, we're going to be getting into that today. Super duper excited about that. <clears throat> super duper excited about that. Last episode, guys, went ahead and set this bad boy up. It has been working like crazy for us. I'm really happy about that. Uh, as you can see, we've got a lot of materials here. We have 72 ender pearls. Like, that is freaking fantastic. We get to use the ender pearls to ender pearl. Yeah, that's the best I could come up with. Anyway, so mechanism. What do we need to do to get into mechanism? Well, we need to make a metallurgic infuser. First of all, because that is the bread and the butter of mechanism. So we got our... Uh, metallurgic infuser. We need some power. We're probably just gonna just gonna steal some from over here because that's where our power's coming from. We'll grab some of the cable, or cable as people like to call it. I don't know. All right, so there we go. Metallurgic infuser. We'll put this guy right here. Cool. What do we do with this? Well, we make some alloys with it. We make a infused alloy with iron and redstone, and then we can make the reinforced alloys, and then we can even take that further beyond uh, and go to the atomic alloys. And then, I'm just kidding, that's, that's the final one. So we're going to be focusing on this, and for now, we do have to use just basic redstone. There is a way to make it a little bit more efficient um, to where more redstone will give you more redstone in here. Um, as you can see, it's only 640 uh, millibuckets, and if we get an enrichment chamber, we can make that so much better. So yeah, this is the enriched redstone. It's so much better to use. It's just, you know, the best ever. So we need quite a few things. Like, we need to start getting into steel, which, by the way, steel is super easy to make with mechanism, so we'll be able to get to that today. All right, so we got four of the infused alloy. Perfect. It's going to be part of a quest. Let's take a look here. Mechanism is pretty far down here. Yeah, starting with mechanism. We're kind of jumping ahead, but I don't really care because we're cool. All right, so we're going to need some osmium as well. Uh, probably wouldn't be a bad idea to get two of these guys going. What do we miss? Just a furnace. That's easy to make. All right, so here we go. I'm also using a new mouse. I, I picked up the Logitech MX Master. Uh, I think it's the second one that everyone loves so much. But I've been using that, and for video editing, it's fantastic. Now, I don't know how it is really for playing Minecraft. I mean, I'm using it now, and I do notice the sensitivity does not go up nearly as high, and I don't know how I feel about that. But other than that, you know, it's pretty pretty legit. Uh, I do like it a lot. So, All right, so we'll get some of these going. Uh, what these are, these are the basic control circuits. Uh, these are pretty much made the exact same way as the alloys, except these use osmium. And these are used for a whole bunch of different machines. They're also used for upgrading current machines that we have. Uh, so we'll be able to go like to a second, uh, the tier two of the metallurgic infuser, which is called the infusion factory. And it just allows us to infuse more redstone into different types. Because right now it's only doing one at a time, and then we could do it three at a time with just that one upgrade. All right, so let's go ahead and do that real quick. I can show you guys the cool upgrade we can do. All right, so if you look here, uh, it pretty much looks identical, except it's got wood in the middle. Um, other than the machine that we, uh, the infuser that we'd put into it. Uh, so all we gotta do is just grab this and shift right click. And as you can see, now it allows us to do three at a time. Super duper cool, bro. So now that that is done, uh, and then we can also make an energy tablet. This holds power. Uh, very simple to make once you have a bunch of these guys. So we can chuck those dudes in here like so. And then we'll come over here, grab the energy tablet like this super easy holds a bunch of power and we have it so cool 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 Ooh, that means we can also make our own windmills oh look how cheap that is holy crap i didn't realize the that was that cheap in this pack all right so windmill it doesn't like it for some reason okay we do need to make a second one which we can now we can make the windmill and now we don't have to buy these anymore but we can just put him up there whenever we're ready. Uh, we are going to make a little area for those guys eventually to go. Uh, but we're not going to do that just quite yet. All right, so we can accept that. Solar generators, these guys are great. As you know, they do the solar. Because the sun 
is a crazy light source in this game. All right, so three of those. One more of these guys. And bada bing, bada boom, we have a solar panel. Generate power every day we are alive. That, that makes no sense. Pay no attention to the man behind the glass, okay? So what we could do is come over here. Just place this dude here. So during the daytime, he's going to help us get some more power. Because, you know, a more power, baby. Oh, the dolphin makes me swim fast, but I wasn't prepared. All right, so something I think we should go ahead and make is the enrichment chamber. Um, yeah, the enrichment chamber, this guy here. Now, it does require a little bit of doing. Uh, we're going to need some steel ingots. Now, these guys normally are a little difficult to make, you know, steel, but with a metallurgic infuser on our side and a bunch of coal, we have the power. So, these guys are pretty much... Good. We don't really need more of those. We're going to dump the redstone. I know we just wasted a whole bunch of redstone. We'll use the rest of this because it's only going to require, I believe, one or two more. Yeah. All right. So, we're going to use the rest of that. That's fine by me. There we go. Now, we can put some coal in there. Coal in there. We're going to grab some iron. This stuff is going to get converted into the cool stuff. I'm just kidding. It's going to get converted into... You guessed it. I didn't guess it. It's going to get converted into enriched iron. Then, we're going to take it for now and just kind of shove it over there to the to the left and this guy's gonna take it and be like oh thanks buddy he's gonna receive it right the enriched iron and then he's gonna make the cool stuff we're also gonna make an upgrade here for it real quick all right quick little basic tier installer to allow for some better things how are we doing on power we're doing okay doing okay on power okay so here we go we got some steel dust perfect we're gonna come over here to our blast furnace because this should do it a little bit faster and we can throw it in there and this will give us the steel that we need in order to make the uh, the steel casing I believe is what it was yes so eventually the mechanism uh, like smelting stuff is going to take over pretty much everything that we do uh, when it comes to like smelting things because they're just so much better in every way every way I promise Make them so fast. So many items can be smelted. They're just perfect. All right, so step one, we have the steel casing, except for this dude. And we have no plates. No plates. So we're going to grab four of those. We need some iron. One, two, three, four. Okay. Plate machine. We'll toss him here. Cool. Going to let these process up, and then we'll continue on. All right, so we should have the required amount for this guy now. Perfect. All right, so then this guy is good to go. There we go. We got the steel casing. Now we can go ahead and we need two of these guys. Oh, we need two pulverizers. Okay, so I'm going to need a lot more electrum and iron smelted or turned into plates. So we're going to do 16 of both. We've got this really cool system set up over here that just makes plates for us. Uh, so we put it into here, our seared melter. It uh, just gets melted up one to one so we don't lose any uh, you know, electrum or anything like that. It gets automatically pumped in here and then just put over here. So whatever we wanna, I guess, whatever we wanna do, we can just do. All right, so we got those guys made up so we can go ahead and make some more of this guy. Cool, we got four of them. All right, so the crusher here. Ooh, look at that, we need steel casings for all of those but good thing is we got a whole bunch of the the steel because we're cool all right get those in there we'll take those okay so we can make one crusher all right so we're gonna be able to make a whole bunch of these steel casings i mean two of them which is pretty neat you know all right so the crushers we need the two pulverizers um yeah looks like we have everything for the two pulverizers i was not expecting that uh, but that's only one crusher, so we do need two more pulverizers, and that's going to require two more of these, <laughs> and we don't have enough. Ah. All right, so we're just going to take a whole bunch of Electrum, get these guys good to go, because we definitely need them. All right, and while we do that, let's go ahead and focus on the copper gears. All right, so we got plenty of copper. Do we still have the press in there? 
We do not. Okay, let's grab the gear press. There it is. Put that, that, there we go. Okay, so that's gonna be good to go in a little bit. Let's check on back here. Yeah, we got a bunch. Cool. This is, that's actually a pretty quick system for getting plates. I'm a big fan. Spider-Man. Okay. So just one. Oh, we need the iron plates. Frick. All right. So we should have enough now to go ahead and, well, we're going to need to make another one of these anyway. But let's do it. Oh, the copper gears. That's right. There we go. We got those, those, all right. This guy, and bam, the enrichment chamber. So cool. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look here. So we're going to take some of that redstone that we have. We're going to go like this, put it in here and get the enriched redstone that we can put into our machines here to get a lot more... Uh, bang for our buck when it comes to that. So let's get back here. Yep, we got all of those. Where was... Oh, amazing machines. Yeah, okay. So this is what we've started doing. Crusher, enrichment chamber. Yeah, so it wants us to do this. Osmium compressor. I don't know. Oh, infuses osmium into other items. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, refined glowstone, refined obsidian. That's pretty much all we need with that. All right, so next wants us, oh, enriched iron. We didn't get the quest for that because it went straight through. Rest in pepperonis. All right, the enriched iron and then the steel dust. There we go, two more quests done. Then we can just grab some steel like this. There we go, steel's good. And then wants us to make another steel casing. I do not have one on me. And we're missing iron again. We burned through iron so fast, guys. Oh my goodness. If only we had a solution. We kind of do, but that's besides the point. All right, steel casing. There we go. We'll probably need that again. And then we just need zinc ingots, huh? We can do that. Ooh, with our little buddy called the, this guy. Called the, this guy. Hang on, we don't want the plates. What are the ingots? Where are the ingots? Okay, zinc ingot. Bam. Starting with mechanism chapter is completed. Is completed. Perfect. Okay, so we can go ahead and get into the tier two stuff because we do have this guy. Uh, yeah, we should be okay. So I'm gonna dump this here real quick. So yeah, 16 gives us 1,280 millibuckets of redstone. As you can see, much more efficient, much better, much more bang for our buck. Okay, so to get into the tier two, we just basically need diamonds in here. Uh, we should be able to take the said diamonds, put them in the enrichment chamber, get enriched diamonds, put them here. We'll dump those. We'll get some more iron so that we can make some more ingots or the infused alloy here. And then this guy will go here and we'll take the alloy that we get from here and put it into here when this one is done so we can put it into here. So many times moving around. All right. So that allows get the let us get the reinforced alloy. Cool thing is we're also going to take a few of these and upgrade our pipes to go a little bit faster. All I got to do is just right click these, which I'm a big fan of, and they instantly upgrade. Yeah, so they're going to move a heck of a ton faster, and they'll do everything better. Grab some more. Upgrade there. Pretty sure that's all been upgraded. Yes, so now the items are moving a heck of a ton faster, which is amazing. Uh, oh, yes, emerald mesh. Forgot to put that back. 
Yeah, already moving much quicker. Sweet. So we got these guys, which is super cool. We can upgrade these again. Heck, why not? Diamonds are easy for us to get now. Oh, that's lame. All right, so those pipes have been upgraded to the reinforced, I think like uh, reinforced here is the name of them, if I'm not mistaken. So we're definitely moving along, which is what I'm happy about. Yeah, these are the same as well. You can upgrade them like that. Just wanted to check. Um, can you do it with these? No. I think you need to do the upgrade for those. All right, so we're going to work on this advanced control circuit. Super easy. Just infuse down my basic. Yeah, it's really easy. Not too crazy. Okay, here we go. Just make a couple of those. And then we should be able to take these... And upgrade to this tier. Yes. All right, so we got two of those. Yeah, once you start getting into mechanism, it kind of just flies. All right, so tier two upgrade. We're missing, or yeah, we're missing those guys. There we go. Bam. Oh, we, we need to make a basic upgrade for that dude. Um, okay, so we'll upgrade the enrichment chamber and then the enrichment chamber again So we can go like this and then we can really get cooking When it comes to making those how are we doing on iron over here? Got just a wee bit just a wee bit of iron Okay, so all the diamonds have been enriched for that uh, to get into the ultimate tier We need these atomic alloys and this requires refined obsidian um, which, you know, enriched obsidian from refined obsidian dust, and you get that from obsidian dust, which you crush. We need to make another crusher real quick. This guy here. So let us do that. Okay, so we can make it. Cool. Um, there we go. And we have our crusher. Super duper neat. We do have a bunch, or not really a bunch, but quite a bit of obsidian kind of sitting here. So it does mean we can do something with it, which I'm happy about. Wait, what? I thought that's how you made obsidian dust. I've been lied to. Uh, it just goes in the enrichment chamber. I feel so dumb. <laughs> well, we have a crusher if we can crush things. That's good, I guess. All right, so then we take these guys, put them in here. We're going to need to make another infuse, uh, metallurgic infuser. All right, there we go. Metallurgic infuser. We're going to put the refined obsidian in there. You know, after these are done processing. Okay, and then the refined obsidian goes in there. It's a good trait. All right, enriched obsidian. Bam, those go in there. We put the reinforced alloy in, and then we get the tier, the top tier dogs. There we go. Check it out. We have two of the atomic alloys, and all we do is we take these like so, like that. Bam, we have the ultimate tier. So cool. We also need to make this guy real quick, which we require two, and I made one. Okay, so now we're going to make the elite tier guy. Uh, kind of lame, you can't just automatically do that. Okay, there's that. I don't know what I'm doing, honestly. Sometimes. Okay, one, two of those. And this guy has been created. Elite tier installer. Bam. Bam. All right, now time to make the one above that, which is the ultimate tier installer. All right, let's go here. Need to make another one of these. We're missing another atomic boy. All right, that's good for now. All right, there we go. We have the reinforced alloys. Now we can make another one of those.
All right. Make one more of these. And so now we just require four of those. Which we will have enough of. All right, and we're about to get the fourth one. Bam, there we go. Let's go ahead and make the ultimate tier. There we go, we got it. Look at all, look at all of that. That is crazy. So much enriching can be done. All right, so this whole area has been done. Mechanism upgrades, speed, energy, gas, muffling. We'll have to go ahead and make those. Osmium compressor, that is actually very simple to make. Let's go ahead and give it a shot here real quick. Okay, so osmium compressor, we gotta do it the weird way like that. All right. We got everything we need, I believe. Yep. There we go. I guess we need to make a bucket. And another one of these guys. Oh, we need to make one more of those guys. And boom, osmium compressor. Boom. So we put osmium in here and it goes in there. I don't know why it wanted us to do that. It fuses osmium into it. Yeah, it makes us some cool stuff. Energized smelter. This is my favorite thing in the world. Redstone furnite. Two of them. Oof. That's expensive. Yep, we're out of electrum again. Because we're freaking nuts. Okay, so that's that's processing, which is good. Uh, that means we can go ahead, come over here. What are we missing? We need some bricks. We got the bricks. Okay, energized smelter. Yeah, we just need one or four more of the plates, one more of those guys. We should be good. Yeah, check it out. We got six cool beans. So this guy here, bam, that's made. This guy here, bam, that's made. And then the energized smelter. Yes. Fast smelting. This stuff, we can upgrade it to this tier as well, so I have just as many of those, and they each smelt differently. Ah, it's so great, I promise. You guys, I love it. All right, so it's precision sawmill. Oof. Oof. Why do you need so much iron? Why can't you use nickel? Okay, so let's go ahead. We should be able... <sighs> just too short. Come on, game. Oh my goodness, look at that. We only have four. Like, we are blasting through our iron so fast. My goodness. Okay, so we should be able to create the sawmill. A saw blade. I am furious. I am the one you want to freaking make Okay. So we have enough iron over here. <laughs> we have 44 left. I think it's actually 45 total, which is really uh, kind of a, a sad tragedy. Okay. Two. Oh, man. Okay. Red. Mm, I don't have any of those. No more ingots. <sighs> okay, so we have the second one coming up here. Yep, just set up a little system where it pushes the red isle of ingots in while we have a good time. So we're going to go ahead and make the precision sawmill now, or basically two normal sawmills. <gasps> what? We're out of copper gears? You game? Why are you doing this? Just let me, let me craft things. Come on. Oh, wait. I already had those. I didn't realize I made one already. When did I make one? Precision sawmill. We did it, I guess. Yay. Okay. So that's good to go. Now we just need to make the upgrades, which 
I believe we can utilize our crusher. Yes. Okay. So we're going to grab some gold. We're going to grab some osmium. I think we're just going to grab like eight of each. And we're going to kind of... That's a, that's it. Uh, that's osmium. Frick. <laughs> that, that's the crusher. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're going to hit A on all of these. And the speed upgrade. Energy upgrade. Gas upgrade. That's iron dust. And the muffling on upgrade with steel dust. So we do have some steel dust. We need to make some iron dust. Okay. I just want four of those anyway. That's a four on. All right, so with that, we have all four of the dusts made that we need in order to make this. So we're just going to pretty much make one of each. We got energy, speed, gas. And muffling. There we go. This one has been completed. The two mechanism. Never mind. There's a mechanism here. We're going to be worrying about that later on. Guys, that has been Mechanism in Seopolis. If you guys found this video helpful, please make sure to hit that like button. And as always, guys, don't forget to subscribe. But this has been Super Turtle, and I'll see you all in the next video. Take care. Peace out.